I'm running and I'm not even in this race. <laughs> hey, yo, viewers. Hi, yo, viewers. And welcome to another New York City vlog. Will this ever go on the internet? Maybe. Who knows? We'll yeah. It's got a mocha from Preda Manger, or how do you say it? In... I say Preda Manger. Yeah. Uh, so, went to the MLB store yesterday and I was like, oh, I need to get something else. Oh man, look at that line for Stardust. We are going to eat there for lunch, about an hour or so, but that's a long line. Because it's so. my dad's favorite restaurant. It's a, it's a Lynn's Reed family favorite. I know Mr. Spoon is going to strongly dislike it. Is the MLB store this way? This way. Um, but he's committing because Billy, Billy loves it. It's part of our family tradition and Mr. Spoon is willing to go where no other Spoon has gone before. No. Except for me, I guess. Yeah, so. And today is the day we see Back to the Future, the musical. I want that vlog's capacitor. Fun fact about Mr. Spoon, he really does not like Broadway style of oh, yeah. singing or performing. He's, it's just not his thing. Rope dropping the MLB store, first customers. All right, done. Got some shirt jerseys, shirzies of Vladdy Jr. and Corey Seager, World Series MVP. Now we're headed to 30 Rock. It's also the uh, St. Patrick's Day Parade. It's, I don't know when when this video is releasing, but St. Patrick's Day is tomorrow. I'm not wearing any green. I left my sunglasses in the room, so I might buy some from a street vendor. Yeah, could yeah. Be the, my dad did yesterday. Yeah, so your brother. Oh, he did? <laughs> he did. Where's the skating rink? There? Where's the tree? Where's the tree? But look up. The tree? Nancy Kerrigan. Yeah. Wanna go skate? No. No? Yeah. Do you? I ice skating once. That was back when the story with Capital of America had a hockey team. I've been ice skating several yeah. times, but that's because I went to college in Minnesota. Oh, Minnesota? Where you would just ice skate on yeah. the lakes. Yeah, can't really ice skate at the store with Capital of America unless it's artificial. Oh, look at that. We went to Rockefeller Plaza and I was like, isn't the Nintendo store nearby? <laughs> MK, it's your store. The store is called Catbird. Two things I really don't like. Birds are fine. Birds are fine, just don't fly in front of me. I see something whimsical up there. Al Roker's not in there. I know. Al Roker. Savannah, you in there? Nintendo! I'm walking here and going into the lunch line. The parade starts at 11, it's around 11, so hopefully the line isn't as long. We passed by maybe an hour ago, it was really long to get in. Never heard of this place until a few days ago, but I guess I was aware of some things about it. Ooh, Stardust merchandise. Get your jazz hands ready. We're going to Ellis. Oh man. It's very small compared to the video. server singing. He sings well, so that's good. There's my food. It's an omelet. It's loud in here. And I got a bagel. Stardust. I ate an omelet. Okay, we got all our stuff, right? All 
was the Nawar Stardust. It's so quiet out here compared to in there. It's very, very good and soundproof in there. Pay that. Where's that 99 cent pizza place? Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> I had no meat with my meal. <laughs> oh, no. I know. That's so sad. It's so loud in there. I couldn't hear that I said lox with my omelet. I know. That's what I... I thought, I'm like, I think he just said cheese. He said cheddar, cheddar, and spinach. Yeah. Like, so oh it's okay. God. He sang, he was the best singer. Our server was the best singer He was there. the best singer. Would you go back there? That was fine. The food was yeah. fine. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it was as expected. Yeah, it's like, like the weight was good. Yeah. We weren't expecting a gourmet meal. We were was, not. Was good. We were not. It was good. Uh-huh. Is there a skewer of meat? <laughs> you want a skewer of meat? Stare blankly ahead Here we are again on the streets of New York. I go a block to Broadway. Today's the day. Today's the day. Great Scott, today's the Great day. Scott. You have an open mind and an open heart. Yeah. Back to the future. The musical I want that flux capacitor. Oh man. <laughs> yeah. Am I singing that loud? What? Am I singing it loud? No, it's just it's a beautiful song. Yeah. Mark Summers, Life in Slimes of Mark Summers. I just want to see Double Dare. I don't want to see. <laughs> there it is. That's not the front of the Teatro, just theater in Spanish, y'all. You know, in 2022, Princess Half Marathon, Princess 10K, I dressed as Doc. There's the ball. There's the ball? Oh, there's the ball. 2024. Yeah. Oh. So we're going to cross. Not cross here. We'll just go up the street. Uh, Ghostbusters. When's the musical coming out? What? Ghostbusters the musical. That would be great. Yeah. How would that go? <laughs> I want to see you play Slimer. Oh, yeah. Stay Puff Marshmallow Man. Paw Patrol on Broadway. <laughs> about to see a beloved 80s movies turn into a musical. I know. It's what great. other beloved 80s movies would you like to see turn into a musical? Tootsie was turned into a musical. I've seen that. Tootsie? It wasn't good. I left during the intermission. Um, what about Gremlins? That would be great. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what Gremlins, other... Gremlins the musical. Goonies. The Goonies? Musical. Oh, man. I'm surprised that hasn't been done. It sounds unnecessary. This this sounds unnecessary also. But here we are. Open minds. Yeah. Open hearts. Yeah. Morty! Oh, Christopher Lloyd. What did you think, Mr. Spoon? Of the back back to the future, the back musical. To the future. We should go uh, back to the future and watch it again. I would watch it again. Wow! I'd watch it again. Wow! Yeah. Fun. Wow. Yes. Last time we saw Aladdin, that was way better than Aladdin. I have I have something to say about Back to the Future the musical. What? I stand corrected. I made fun of it before I saw it and thought that's probably terrible. It exceeded it's my not, expectations. Not, it's not terrible. It was not terrible. It was no. It was fun. They were talented. Some really cool special stage effects. Yeah. I am. I would good. see it again. <laughs> I would get my DeLorean and watch it again. So. Yeah, we were we were surprised, all of us in our in our party. Yeah. Not a one was not surprised. So, well done, well, casting crew. Like all of the all of the scenes that made that movie famous, or most of them were present in there. And you said it well. It, they were. It's a self-aware musical. Yes. <laughs> They're not trying yes. to be serious. That's when it get. That's when. It, that's what's gonna get me into it. Is a self-aware musical. They're not trying to win a Peabody or anything. Oh, siren. Welcome to New York. They know their genre and they own it. We're eating in like an hour and a half, but I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm painfully aware that I'm running a half marathon here yeah. tomorrow up this uphill. Last what kind of oh, snack would you like? Maybe there's there's pancake cake in our room. There is. Do you want meat on a stick though? I, I don't know. I need that. Lots of meat on sticks. Yeah. Here we are at the dinner place. Dinner has been eaten, seen by the photos on the screen. Just got very cold. 
Yeah, it's cold. It's nice. <laughs> yeah. It's nice. Just sitting here in the Upper East Side. Probably not. No. No, we're not. We? We're in Greenwich Village. Greenwich, Greenwich. Village. No. Isn't that where the Beatles are from? No. Honey, darling. No. But we, it was delightful. I like Osteria 57. It was good. I'm full. A good full. I ate all of my tiramisu. Probably only one bite was not eaten by me. That's true. It was it's good. me. Yeah. My pasta was exactly exactly what I was hoping for when you come to New York I was saying earlier at dinner when I come to New York I'm not eating Mexican food I'm not eating donuts I do want Italian they're just oh and we don't eat barbecue when we're in New York even now well I don't eat steak anymore but even now like if I did it would be hard to eat steak here I ate steak last night <laughs> oh yeah yes you did but it's like it was at a Cuban thing and that was uh, yeah it was, it was good steak. when you live in texas you know you you've got mexican you got steak you've got donuts what you don't have is you don't have really good italian i'm not looking forward to running half marathons of my own oh i'm gonna sleep in i wish it was like a disney one i wish they were like four hours you're gonna be great that's the only part that's that's the wild card factor that i'm like you may see an inspirational reel of them talking about and we stay till our final finisher and it might be me i might be the final yeah. finisher we'll be watching her run the top of the empire state building <laughs> almost top of the empire state yeah, building yeah that, that's not a lie they're going to go to the top of the empire state building an hour after i start so you will you you will be able to see me probably yep. in the crowd oh here comes our car here comes the uber hey viewers it's another day and there is a mile 11ish of the new york city half Linz has not started yet. This is, uh, and I am not running. We're going to a Korean bakery that we went to a couple days ago, then going to the Empire State Building, and then we'll meet up with Linz again, but we're walking away so we can catch an Uber. But look at that. That's, that's why I heard things outside of my hotel. Fast forward, we're here in Koreatown, back to Tout Le Jour. Every streetway looks like a scene from Inception. All right, got the sausage thingy, sweet rice ball, like a, a bean cake, and sweet corn ball, a red bean donuts, and some mochi. West 33rd Empire State Building. We'll come in. Oh, there's Minnie. Oh, there it is. Lean Bill. Oh, this is riveting. Opening day. It's not about baseball. Movies to showcase that. Wonder Woman. That's a long last one. It's a fine film right there. Celebrities that have been here. It's Mickey and Minnie are there. So all I want for Christmas is you. Some blonde up there. Welcome to the world's most famous building, and you get to see it built. Something useful, will you? All right, we're coming up to the 80th floor. You're headed to the top of the Empire State Building. Of this, uh, oh, 80th floor here on the Empire State Building. It does feel like it's waving a little bit. Of course, like went to One World Trade Center. That's like hundreds of stories. Still good view of the city. Here's some more views. There is the aforementioned One World Trade Center over there. And then in the distance, you can see the Statue of Liberty. There's more buildings, buildings, and buildings. 86 out of this elevator. Dun, da, 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 da. The sleeveless in Seattle look like there's a, a lot more room. There's some Wonos over there. Look at that. It's a party there. All right. Try to find Linz on the course. 
I think she's this way. She just passed the Sheraton. Oh, I see her. She's up there, the PR and fun black jacket. I'm running and I'm not even in this race. <laughs> oh no, she's running. <coughs> Is she right there? What's the It's the black right there. Black? Yeah. We see you, but we don't have a Coke. I'm actually running, I'm not even in this race. I see you. We're on the left side, me and Adam. We lost the parentals because we started running. Uh, just going up and ride across the Starbucks. <coughs> right here. We have no Coke, though. <laughs> <laughs> Adam, a bunch of you run. How was that? Was that so fun? It was great. Was it great? I didn't I drink now. Good job. I Good job running, guys. You did yes. so good. I'm going fast. I know you are. Like you're oh, way going. ahead of where you used to say you were. Yeah, I'm like way ahead. You want me to grab a cup from a car? Nah, I'm fine. Okay. Yeah, okay. I'll grab a cup for you. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Okay. I love you guys. Bye. You have to do this. Okay. It's like, it's so <coughs> hard, and I've never heard the F word so many times before because the hills are dumb, but it is. Oh, we saw it, someone on the way to Empire State, and it was like, woo. I think the last one. No. What? Good. All right. All right. Love you. Love All right. You. Okay, we just caught her, and she oh. took off. We had to run and then tell her to stop running. <laughs> there, we ran part of the New York City half. There you go. Didn't even train for it. Yeah. Woo, and that's time for a slice. <laughs> <laughs> Here we are on the elevator. I just finished the New York City half marathon. Not just, I came back and I showered. And yeah. Read my face yeah. beautiful. Let's look at your medal. Oh yeah. It's a little cute medal. It's a little cute. A little yeah. cute. NYC hat. No, I'll be okay with this one living in a drawer. <laughs> well, metal. It was a fun race. It was yeah. clarifying that I don't think I want to do the New York City Marathon, not because I didn't love this race, but because I think I only loved it for 13 miles <laughs> with yeah, all the hills. Yeah. But 13 to, miles, perfect. I had to run a couple blocks of it. So. Yeah, you did. That was fun. Do you yeah. have that on video? Oh, yeah. It's all on camera. Good. Yeah. Now we're gonna refill ourselves with some Jewish deli pastrami. Which one did you order? Number four. We just did number four. It just said number four. A good restaurant. I'm so full. And here's our Uber. Second half deli in New York. Midtown fashion. Look at that. Oh. Oh, here we go. Bazaar by Jose Andres. Same guy who does Haleo, which we like to eat that a lot at the WDW. Thank you. It's first Jose Andres restaurant with chopsticks. It's also very nice in here. Um, on the Jose's creative experience, I don't believe there's a single thing. Someone better go. This was the tuna charter. No. Some chicken candy. Got our Berico ham. Very good. And our olives. Cotton candy foie gras. I've never eaten anything like this before. Never in my life. Yeah. Adam. Want to do it? Adam did it. Do you recommend one bite? Okay. Yeah. All right. Like a, a do better it. To it. Mm, word, I'm going to choke. Yeah. There is. No, no, but there is like a gooey center. It's good. Mmm. Okay. Just not small. Mm. I, can't, I can't do this in one mouth. Wow. I mean, my mouth is too small. In the middle. So. <laughs> that was like a Willy Wonka moment. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was like a. Willy Wonka. Willy Wonka. What is that? It's a tuna fried egg. You just so roll it up and eat it in one bite. Or crumple it up and eat it in one bite. Yeah, I kind of I'm going to try and roll it up. It's a quail egg. Mmm. 
Chicken karage and oh, fried cool. chicken. We'll write it all down oh, wow. in the notebook later. You like that, Billy? That's quality. Ugh. I melt in your mouth. Oh, that's good. Mm. Lobster and potatoes or something. Yeah. And sauce. To accompany our ensalada de bombante, I have our miso honey egg. Ooh. Oh, that's probably really yeah. good. Sweet and salty dish with pine nuts. Lobster. Mmm. That's good. Miso eggplant. Wagyu. Here, would you like to take it No, we prefer to use your chopsticks. So what's before us is Wagyu, and we only have chopsticks. And just mere seconds ago, I was talking about how the best steak in my life was just eating with chopsticks, and lo and behold, Wagyu steak is in front of us, worth just chopsticks. Let's try it. It's not as tender, but it's so good. It's not as tender as Takumi it's Tate. So looks good. Like, it looks very good, though. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, no, it's very good. Very good. Very good. Are you happy today? Oh my god. <laughs> Swag you airbread. It's gonna has Manchego cheese inside. Airbread. It's like an airplane. Yeah, I saw that like, they posted something. I was like, that looks interesting. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, let's try it. Choose your weapon. Yeah. Senior Spooner. Wow. <laughs> Good. Here, Dave, take a bite of this, and then we'll give that to somebody else, okay? Well, let me, I'll take a bite of the hand, okay? Oh, yeah. Wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's the best thing I've eaten today. There's my answer. That's so good. The melted manchego in there. Yeah, go for it. <laughs> this dessert's very good. Not yet, but I'm eating my. Mmm. Isn't that amazing? No, that's fresh. The dough is... It's big? Yeah. Back on the streets of New York City. They're one of the best meals of our life. Do you yes. agree with that? Yes, 100%. I would like to sit down and make a list someday of the best meals of our lives. and But this this will be top, at least top five. Oh, it was very good. I was saying it was uh, one of the best culinary days of my life, starting at a Korean bakery for breakfast. <laughs> Nice deli for lunch, excellent best is crummy, and then here, another Jose and Dress restaurant, um, you know, in love, um, it's very good. It is definitely the best Jose Andres restaurant I've ever, ever yeah, been Yeah, it's to. like uh, Haleo at Disney Springs is child's play. It looks, it makes Haleo look like Blaze Pizza. It's still very good. Still very good. Blaze Pizza is good too. Yeah, exactly, that's why I chose Blaze, yeah. it, but it makes it look, Yeah. yeah, that was outrageously good. Two of my favorite cuisines. Yes. I don't hear you making audible sounds very often when you're eating. Oh, like I'm mid like mm -mm, and oh. while the men while the melted manchego is yeah. drizzling down my face. <laughs> and it did indeed drizzle down your face. Yeah. Oh, there's a Mickey D's down the street. <laughs> the shamrock shake, it is. Get a little nightcap St. quarter Patrick's pounder. Day today. You see with an unsweet tea. Yeah. Hey, yo, viewers. Hey, yo, viewers. It's day three of this vlog. Yo. We're gonna get some breakfast, some bagels. Yes, on. yes, I'm very excited to get my bagel. We were going to go to one of my favorite restaurants, Balthazar, but it turns out my brother didn't know we'd still be here and forgot to include us in the reservation, but I was not sad, because now I get my bagel. Bagel. Let's go, Upper East Side? No. 
Okay. No, not at all. Fast forwarding to another area, not on the Upper East Side of New York City, near Chinatown, going to the Bagel Place. I don't, I'm just walking. No idea. I didn't see any bagel place. Yeah. What do you call these little little buildings with extra seating? Um, Is there a name for that? Here we are at Russ and Daughters, where Russ and his daughters are gonna cook us food. And they have eggs. Mm. Eggs Benny. Which has neither eggs nor cream. Oh yeah. Really? Let's see what we ordered. Just ordered some uh, bagels. Some smoked salmon, cream cheese, all that good stuff. This is like a like a fancy deli. Huh? It's like fancy. It's not down home, but I'm okay with it. Bagel. Boy, I'm a bagel. <laughs> and cream cheese. Look at that salmon. There's a pretzel bread bagel with pastrami salmon. That looks very good. Very good. I'm gonna turn off the camera so I can eat. Mm. Oh. Schmear. Got some challah bread pudding with dried apricots and caramel sauce. Chocolate egg cream. Which contains no eggs or cream. No eggs or cream. Look at that. Look at that. Good. Feels like childhood. So lovely. Good. Mm. Yeah. Not too sweet either. And so, oh. back to the hotel room. Yeah, bagel to the fatigue. airport. Yeah. So, time to go home. Time to go. We love for more, for more adventures. The next videos will be from Disney World, potentially. Maybe. But until then, like, subscribe, and tell your mom about this.